Oh shit, I forgot sales came out. Niggas was copping all type of pleas this week, bro. Yo, yo, I ain't gonna lie. Should I start with YB first or like Meat Mill and Rick Ross? Hey, them, that YB better crowd has gone ghost. Hold up. I got, nah, let, let's talk about it. Nah, we gonna talk about it. We gonna talk about it. We gonna talk about it. We gonna, we gonna talk about that shit. The YB better crowd has gone ghost. Y'all remember all them niggas who used to have like YB with like hats on on the, on the PFP on Twitter? What the fuck they been at? Because they ain't streaming music no more. Chat, did y'all see this shit? You know what's crazy? <coughs> this is the first young boy project in the last four they said was hot. This shit's still flopping. I'm asleep. Hey, y'all young boy fans, where have y'all gone? Don't tell me y'all niggas got detention or something. I would have gave y'all an excuse if it was like the summer. I'm like, oh, oh okay, maybe y'all got summer school. Where y'all go? The YB Better crowd has moved on expeditiously. I do have a theory on it. After they seen YB and McConan twerking in that Urus, they seen YB off the four loco, popping it. They, it's, 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 hey, didn't I tell y'all? He ain't doing 100K no more. Hey, I will say this one more time. Until the United States government let young boy out of Utah, he will not see another successful album pass 100K. Because the music he making there is on some other shit, man. He making mentally depressed, sexually ambiguous music. That shit ain't flying. All that real stepper shit. Brother, you're just stepping in the snow, walking around the crib, man. Ain't nothing happening. Come on now. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. Now, I forgive him. I do forgive him because, you know, it's really hard and tough to make, you know, inspired music. But I will say this. This is my last thing. I know some of y'all think, like, I'm not now like a hater of YB. Like, get that nigga dick out your mouth, okay? Get that nigga dick out your mouth, okay? Listen, <laughs> I, I, I don't owe nothing to no rapper, all right? <laughs> the same way I talked about me, I talk about everybody, so fuck all that. Let me just say this. Young boy, I'll say this to you. Your fans just told you you was walking around with an air of cockiness and an air of arrogance thinking whatever, like, your shit don't stink or, like, whatever you give them, they're going to eat up? No, brother. Your fans have clearly told you they ain't going for it no more. You need to come give them what they want because all that other shit you doing, that faux loco, I'm high all the time shit, ain't working. Your fans has finally spoken. They've told you, like they tell everybody, Drake fans just told him, you ain't bigger than the fucking program, nigga. So you either go get back to making that murder, murder, kill, kill music, nigga, but all that other shit you was talking in that soft voice on Billboard, I just want to stop the violence and... I know how my, I know how many people got guns in their hands because my me no nigga no no nigga no no nigga nope 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 keep doing it no nah, they, they that's not what they want no nah, nope nope you see sometimes these artists really think that whatever they say the fans go rock with hell to the no no hell no nigga all that little I'm so so, so sorry I just I'm sound like Mike Tyson I don't know what's Going on. I'm sorry, I'm, you know, this kind of make me feel like I was just like, you know, I just feel like, <laughs> yo, no, 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 they don't want to hear that bullshit, no, nigga, no, nigga, start screaming again, start screaming, we want the screaming, all of that other shit, like, no, I want to just like, no, nigga, no, 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 nigga, no, 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 start screaming, we want screaming, 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 that's what we want, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, <laughs> The fan spoke. Don't get mad at me. Why are you mad at me for? Why are you mad at me for? I'm telling you the truth. The fans just spoke. 
They say they want mad young boy. They don't want this other guy. All right. And then I was like, oh, my God. Like, that was like a nuclear bomb. Like, I didn't even, I'm like, yo, how do you deal with this? You know what I mean? You, come on, nigga. <laughs> you look like you stink. Like, nigga, you look like you got halitosis, nigga. You look like a corpse. I'm sorry to say to you, okay? I don't care how much young boy puts you in the passenger seat and drive you to motherfucking Dairy Queen. You look like you stink. And I still can't forget the time you tried to fuck Drake and Drake had Chubbs toss you out of the fucking OVO party like Jazzy Jeff. I'm sorry. Your career ain't never been the same since. Young boy tried to give you a song. Then you try to out niggas who even tried to take the song was half decent. Told my Sway Lee, why are you talking to me like that? Nigga, you look like you stink through the screen. Sorry, people. Just tell the truth. That's why they don't like me. Watch this. <laughs> Watch this loose this loose tongue lisp ass nigga. Watch him come to try to get him. I can't that makes like you know you, you some it's some of these gay niggas, man. They got an extra spit. It's like an extra reservoir. Like just like I don't know where it's at. But wait till he and young boy didn't even tell you to get in the shower. That's fucked up. That's not a friend. He ain't say, God damn it, nigga. What is, what is that stench? McCona, get your stink ass in the fucking shower, nigga. But 35K. This shit fucked up, chat. Uh, I don't really know. I, uh, you know, they, they, they were trying to tell me like, you know, I feel so, I, I feel so bad that I, 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 I my, 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 my music. My, my, my. God, come on, nigga, get off of that shit, nigga. You says you a stepper. We want to hear how you sliding on that. What's that nigga name that got robbed at the mall? Lou Ryan. Where's the diss track at? Tell me how you had your goose take his chain. <laughs> Young boy, that's all they want to hear from you, bro. Young boy, nobody want to hear no positivity from you, bro. We already know you like a devil's child. We don't want no positivity from you. You can't come back. You already cemented your place in hell. You can't escape. I'm sorry. You like King Vaughn, nigga. You, you going to sit right next to that nigga holding hands when the, the devil burning y'all both. I'm sorry. It's over. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> oh, no, I want to stop the violence. I wanna, oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, the fans is like, nigga, what? <laughs> nigga, start the violence. <laughs> can't, nigga, you can't go from shouting and looking like this every time to be like, yeah, you know, my, my music, like, I just want, like, I met this Mormon family. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, how many times you want the Bass Pro goods, nigga, and cop them outfits? What happened to the album? Still stopping! My bad, my bad, my <laughs> yeah, my bad, chat. This is all jokes. This is all jokes. This is all jokes. It's my little comedy part of the stream. My comedy show coming up soon, chat. Y'all gotta come check me out. This is all jokes. I forgive young boy chat. I'm going to tell you why. For the last 600 days, this nigga has gotten dressed just to go to the living room like it's fucking Thanksgiving, nigga. I see this nigga in a full fit. <laughs> this nigga got the chains, matching drip, the shoes. It's always something new. Just to go to the living room and the garage, record a video, and go back in his, his pajamas. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I forgive him. I forgive him. Yeah, don't get mad at the music now. Imagine getting the drip right. And nigga, you could only go into two rooms. Living room, garage.
All right, let's take this shit off. All right, cool. Let's get back in the pajamas. Sorry. What's this shit right here? What the page is this? Hold up, chat. By the way, oh. By the way, as I said, this is just jokes. If you get mad at anything I said here, I'm going to tell you, you wouldn't pull up on Kevin Hart like this. You wouldn't pull up on Dave Chappelle like this. But hold up, wait a fucking minute. Wait, wait. IFWTC says, Act, why are you being disingenuous? Why B sales are only dropping because of house arrest? He's on. If he was dropping music when he's free, he would easily sell 100K. Bro, stop the cap, my nigga. Bro, let's be honest. If Youngboy was not on house arrest and versus him being on house arrest, the only thing that would change is the quality of the music. That nigga act like he's too good to promote his music. He don't do interviews. He don't do shit. So I don't want to hear nobody tell me like, oh, it's because he's on house arrest. My nigga, the nigga don't even like promoting his own music. Half the time, the nigga's Instagram is deactivated. So don't tell me it's because he's on house arrest. He dropped most of his shit when his shit was deactivated. The nigga don't like promoting shit. <laughs> the point is this. Young boy has reached a saturation point. This is what happened with every rapper. You get in the dick riding phase where every fan act like your shit can't stink. And that's where when everybody had them YB, F, FPFs on Twitter, whatever he put out, they were going to eat it up. After they seen him doing a little flexible shit and also he dropped a couple joints that didn't really hit, bro, niggas that fell off. Like, bro, he had dick riders rocking with him. If he was free right now, yeah, he probably sell more than 35K if he tried. But he, like, play like this. Remember when he was free? The nigga didn't do shit to promote his music, my nigga. Tell me, y'all be honest with me. If Youngboy was free, again, I'm agreeing with you, the quality of the music would be better. But what, what would, but what would he, what would he have done? What would he have done? Right? What would he have done that would have um, made any difference or what he, would he have done differently that he's not doing now? Bro, the last time he sold over 50,000 was when he claimed I went bad on him saying him and Dirk was, was, was not beefing. Nigga, he used Dirk to get the 60K. After that, with like, my nigga, y'all don't want to admit about young boy. Young boy needs the beef, my nigga. I'm sorry to tell y'all. He needs the beef. Like, without the beef, without the controversy, he's not selling, bro. I'm sorry. Y'all don't want to hear it. Without the beef, without the controversy. And by the way, if I'm him, nigga, I would steal this Dirk. This is if I'm him. Nigga, I need them sales. Fuck out of here, nigga. I need that big contract. I mean, Dirk keep acting like, like, you see, Dirk is a great bait and switcher. Like, they, Dirk be acting like he about to diss that nigga and then don't diss him. Dirk be like, yo, I'm really coming for the ops on my album date. Make sure y'all check out my album, my album date. I'm going to really kill the ops on that one. Rest in peace, Vaughn. We sliding for you now. The, the, the album drop, and it's a bunch of love songs and bunch of great, uh, we are the world. Oh, my life. Yeah, he ain't dissing nobody. He bait and switch y'all stupid ass niggas. He's smart. Young boy be just getting so mad, he looking at the screen like he's trying to, like he's spitting at the camera and shit like that. Nigga, that's what you need to do every time. Act like you beefing. That's what makes the numbers go up. Nigga, it's the facts. Niggas don't want to hear you make the same 55 songs on the fucking mountain up in Utah. Act like you about to diss everybody like you normally do. Yo, fuck you, Dirk. Matter of fact, we about to rap about when you got robbed. Even if he never got robbed, just make it up. Like, these niggas, like, again, I, I'm just telling y'all, they both need the beef. They bait it in different ways.
Y'all don't like when I tell the truth. I tell the truth, y'all start getting mad. No egg. <sighs> and I'm gonna be honest with you. Was I surprised Young Boy Flop? Yes! Because I like this album. But you know what it is? Niggas tired of the bullshit with him. Niggas tired of the bullshit with him, man. Young boy tried to do the cardinal sin. He thought he was that lit that he could tell his fans, hey. He thought he was that lit he could tell his fans, yo, I'm only promoting nonviolence. They looking at him like, nigga, we only like you for the violence. All right, anyway. I don't hate Youngboy. Youngboy is my friend. We're going to be back friends like... I'm actually planning out. Me and Youngboy are going to be friends by April. He just need to cuss me out three more times. I'll cuss him out once. And then we'll be back friends. Chat, I still can't believe that nigga Diddy 